A legendary astronomer and TV presenter, Sir Patrick Moore, was in Birmingham to give the Sunday Mercury an exclusive interview. He told us how life on Mars will be discovered within the next ten years. We're looking for life theory, therefore it must be life. Our galaxy contains a hundred thousand million stars. We know a thousand million galaxies, there are plenty of planets there, and there must be Earth, but of course we haven't found it yet. The one thing you don't know is this. There are many worlds where life could exist, mm -hmm. but if life can appear, will it? That's what we haven't actually proved, and the key may be Mars. If we find any trace of life on Mars, and it's not Earth contamination, mm -hmm. then we show life has to be widespread. What is your hunch? Oh, is there life out there? I'm sure it does, but I can't prove it. Obviously, we get in 10 years, I may be able to tell the answer. Okay, obviously, you know, 1957 when you launched, it was like a exciting time. First 20 years, you saw, you know, Sputnik and the lunar landings and Apollo. I mean, what are your memories of that time? It must be very exciting. We had everything at once. Um, the start of the space age, the opening of the Georgia Bank, everything going on at once. I very much hope when we do have a lunar base, it's going to be international. Otherwise, it won't work, and I hope it will be. I've read that... Um, you once played the xylophone with uh, Albert Einstein, with him on the violin, you were jamming together. Is this true? I was in the America, the very start of the war, mm -hmm. learning how to navigate an aircraft. So I went here at the start of the war. Yeah. I was on it doesn't matter. <laughs> and um, I went out to America, I was doing our course there. Uh, I've been to Canada, got out of America for a week, mm -hmm. Steve. And a little reception there, and there was a cadet with a white flash, invited, and Einstein was there. So it was all right. And I talked about him. And based on a little reception, again, I was there. Einstein was a very good violinist. Quite well. yes. yeah. He'd been playing at the concerts. He said, mm -hmm. well, somebody said, do you still violin? He said, cool. I had played the swan, there's no piano. Saint-Saëns swan was a piano, and I knew it. Mm -hmm. So I come to Einstein, oh, for the tape. There weren't any tapes in 1940. Yes. Thank you very much for your time. You appreciate it.